Welcome everybody, Big Charlie here, here on my vlog channel. I'm here in at Henderson Park in Pasquant's home to, to the Richie Lou Apartments where the famous hurricane party happened. Come with me, will you? What happened here was the famous Richie Lou Apartments where the famous hurricane party here happened. August 18th, 1969 is when Hurricane Camille was coming through of past Christian, Mississippi. According to the legend, a famous hurricane party happened here where there was a bunch of different stories of what had happened. The hurricane party consisted of around 24 people. The sheriff came that night and told these people to get out. They refused. They were having their party in there on the third floor of the, of the apartment complex. 25 feet waves were coming in smashing it in place, destroying it, killing everybody except for one person. According to a bunch of stories that I've heard, it was a boy that floated away on a mattress. The other one was a lady crawled out the window and held onto a tree until the storm was over with. Neither one of them has been plausible or been proven. It is unknown, but there were deaths here. Speed up to 1989, roughly 1990, is when they built a shopping center here. It was a Dell Champs subway, it had an eye doctor here, and a video store here. When they were building this place, they kept the original slab here. It has been covered up. The swimming pool here is still here too. It is covered up. But when they built a new place, they built a new slab on top of it. They put a layer of dirt on top of the old slab and built a new slab on top of it. 2005, Hurricane Katrina came here, wiped this place out. For many years, they cleaned it up and just had an empty vacant lot until recently about oh, about two years ago funding came here from FEMA to turn this into something I think it was FEMA I'm not for sure don't quote me on that but anyway the remnants of the old Richie Little Apartments is still here but like I said buried here also here they have been claimed there's paranormal activity that's happened here because of the death of people that have died here so I'm going to show you where and what Right here on top of this hill was where the, the swimming pool area was. Uh, they All they did was came in and bury it, and that was it. It's still here to this day. You can tell how much dirt they put up on it. It's still here. And right here in the very back of the park is where the original slab was. And it's still buried underneath here under about three foot of dirt, still here to this day. Yep, yep, there's a mount of dirt here and you can tell where it was. And at night, if you come here at night, this place will give you the heebie-jeebies because there is been reported a paranormal activity here at nighttime. Right there is where the woods are at. That's where they claim where the, uh, on the second part of the story is where the woman hung onto the tree. Uh, I don't know which tree it was, but they say it was in this area where all them people died too, on the third story. So there you have it. This is the famous where the Richie Lou Apartments was. The 1969 Hurricane Camille, August 18th, 1969 is when that happened. Death and destruction came to this wonderful little area. But we have recovered and we're moving on. Nothing's going to stop us. Beautiful day today here at the park. Till next time, everybody.